Leave me be, will ye? Is true. No lie in the legends. Did you sever his head? Head of a giant on your mind. Greetings, traveler. Got back your stolen horn, and I, uh, killed the thieves. Shame that. They weren't evil men. Didn't give me a choice. Where's my reward? Take it. And next time, slay some damn monsters. Drink last night too? What is it? You're clearly a fighting man with many journeys neath your belt. I'm in need of your help. You see, it's me Sonny. I'm worried. Left home a fortnight back and hasn't returned. Will you see what's become of him? Would you mind? Let's talk about my reward first. It's a lot. I need to borrow from Kid. Would you have it? 
won't spare no coin for me, boy. Where should I look for your son? East of here, midst the ruins of the fortress. He went there with some rogues from Pharaoh. Met him at the tavern. They filled his head with nonsense about some treasure. I said, Sonny, Pharaoh folk are liars to a man. You shouldn't fraternize with him. But he knew better. How'll I recognize him? All I know is he doesn't listen to his father. Pretty typical for his age. His name's Olve. A cheerful lad. A bit of a lisp. Nothing special about his looks. Except last I saw him, he was wearing a yellow tunic. Lovely. None other like it in the village. Got it from me a year back, on his birthday. That ought to do it. I'll look around. No promises, though. Well, my dad's off. Watch it. all over the body, but those indicate feeding. He died from a blow to the head. Interesting, the fiend.
across to the other side. This way, toppling trees. Won't get away this time. Yellow tunic. Must be Ove. Avenged those boys. There's that at least.
That's it, Roach. Nice barrel, lads, stick together. It'll all work out. Greetings. Any tidings? Bad ones. Your son's dead, killed by a fiend. All I could do was avenge him. I told him, son, nothing good ever came out of Pharaoh. Stay home. Your time will yet come for adventures and glory. Your reward. This gold brought me no luck. May it serve you better. Fine beauty. Golden hair. Oh, and gave her up to Freya. Let's not talk at all. Beware the bandits that lurk in the highlands. What? My dad grew pale like you just for a day? You're a witch? Others say evil works got water on the brain. Ah. Talk to yourself and then do you meet? Imagine? Very fear. Where'd you hear that? Tell the yarn. He's in charge. Ah. Remember last year? No one is horse playing right off that cliff. Aye, aye. Lad died young. For something beautiful, though. I leave my home to if Chalva dies? Who'll continue my line? Mind if I interrupt? Nay. My prayers are in vain anyways. Here you're having trouble with a curse. I... I am. Look. See it lying there. A horse head on the pole. That's... A knithing. Kind of curse, seen this before. They're nothing to scoff at, can bring misfortune, even death. Aye, and the name carved upon it is Tialva, my firstborn. Boy's feverish, grows weaker by the day. I fear I'll bury him before the next moon. Tried to lift the curse myself, but. No luck. I can help you, one of two ways. First, I can try to convince whoever put up the knithing to lift the curse themselves. Second, I can deflect the curse back on whoever cast it by writing their name on the shaft. Either way, I need to know who's behind this. But I don't trouble no one. Don't know a soul who'd wish it upon me. Mm-hmm. Guess I gotta investigate. Curse. 
Name carved on the shaft. Tjalva, son of Lothar. Trails fresh. Hmm. Might want to look around some. Too many scents. Can't follow my nose any further. Need to ask around about the shawl. Greetings. Best blade's not worth shite if a weak arm's swinging it, eh? Greetings, white hair. Can you swing an axe? God, I've met. Aye. Take what brings ye here? He listens and you can Where's your road, Wayne? Guardian curse. Hey there. You a wraith from more uh, Greetings. Greetings. Mind if I have a look at your herbs? See ya. Fare thee well. Beware the, the bandits that lurk in the highlands. And Holgar was among them. Very fear. Where'd you hear that? Uh, a witcher, eh? Maybe just uh, invite her for a sniff. To... You heard? Yeah. Me dad we feel like you just for a day. Feeling any better? Other Aye? Side. What's it you need? Any chance you know who wore this shawl? Of course. Yona. Our herbalist lives there in that hut. Oh, she'll be pleased you found it for her. Yeah, real pleased. Where'd you hear that? Vacant. Must be the one beyond. Found your shawl near Lothar's house by the nithing you put up there. How did you know? Had a hunch. Thanks for confirming it. You know Tjalv has got one foot in the grave. Good. That bastard should never have been born. Me, I was to be Lothar's bride, but he cast me aside for that flounder. Getting his comeuppance now. Him and that whole plowing family. You'd kill a child out of jealousy? Are you serious? It is not jealousy, but dignity that matters here. Ten years we lived side by side. Ten years, I cooked for him, washed his breeches, shared me bed. And he abandoned me with nary a word. The whole village laughed. Stupid bent Yona let herself be had. No, I have not been had, nor have I forgot. Want you to lift the curse. I mean it. Fine, I'll do it. But I've my terms. Lothar's to renounce his son and come back to me. I'll be sure to tell him. But I think we both know what his answer will be. The sorceress, Yennefer, right? What's that supposed to mean? So, 
you know who placed the knife in? Old friend of yours, Yona. I might have guessed. Jealous bitch! Can't stand to see others happy. So? Will she lift the curse? Yeah, sure. All you gotta do is renounce your family and go back to her. Nay. Never! My wife. My son. I'd strip them of honor. Condemn them to poverty. You've gotta break the spell, Witcher. Let her die! Can't do that. Yona doesn't deserve it. And my son? Does he? No. But he doesn't have to die. You have a choice. All right. If it'll save Chalva, I'll go back to the hussy. And you... Best not see your face round here again. can come out. They're dead. Who are they? Bandits. Matman Lugos' man. And who are you, my good man? Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. Thanks for your aid. If you'd not come by, we'd have been done for. Lugos will wonder what happened to his men. What'll you do? Don't worry about us. Send my boy off to care troll the hasty like. The Earl's not like to let Lugos off. You best watch your own back. Lugos finds out, he'll try to get even. Think I'll manage. Good luck. Where are you walking? Thank <laughs> you. 
Maybe he's looking to get hired oh, on the you ship. Walking? You put it here, hold it, and chop. Right. I know that already. Are you pouting? Well, my dad's off fighting Ooh, the black hands. And I want to build a well. Maybe the got time. Ah, that's come. how you earn respect. You got a get a the That's exactly okay. how. Look. Brings it to me. Wouldn't mind a look at your wares. Looking to buy? Show me your wares. So long. Don't. 
perfection is soon. Breath. Move it. Get them. I'll bear you sons. Strong and healthy ones. You'll see. Well, will you say anything? Leave me be, woman. here.
That's it, Roach. With our hey, own a witcher! <coughs> Freya be praised. Witcher, help! <coughs> and then what? Then nothing. Never you mind. This here's a job for a witcher. As you wish. What's the problem? A beast. It attacked me. Me and my comrade. We'll gut the fucker. Aye, but not us. The Witcher. Why bother the witch man? Like as not it were a pack of wolves. But they got you so afeard you shat yourself and sore specters. Let me round up a few sturdy lads and we'll... Won't be needed. The Witcher will help, right? You shan't let us down. Feral folk. Dumbest dumps. That hunter, could he be right? Maybe it was just wolves. I knows what I saw. Besides, who's he to say? Those drum and blaggards don't know shite from shoelaces. That particular blaggard was wearing on crate colors. Uh, you sure about that? Sure than sure. Ugh, doesn't matter. That lot's not to be trusted either. Monsters attacked me. I need a witcher, not some hunter. You from Pharaoh? Come a long way. That just happened. Came to Fearsdale to trade a load of hides from Svorlag. Svorlag? Thought you were from Pharaoh. Svorlag's on Speakerog. Uh, ah, well, you see, first I sailed from Pharaoh to Svorlag. Traded some loot from the continent for hides there, then came here. Pharaoh to Spikarog to Ard Skellig. <laughs> Roundabout journey. I hadn't much choice, had I? A merchant sails where the trade's good, not where it's close at hand. Fine. What's this about? Tell me. Me and my mate were on our way here to Fearsdale with a cart full of hides. Suddenly we heard a screech. Our horse got spooked, started kicking, and then monsters jumped out of the bushes. My mate drew the short straw. They got him first. By some miracle, I managed to get away. What kind of monsters? Nekuks. No doubt about it. What? You know, sharp claws, animal skulls on their heads, attacking swarms. Neckers? Yeah, neckers. Near 20 of them. So will you help? Will you kill the bastards? That road needs to be clear. Aim to travel it again soon. Huh, don't know. You lost your transport, so I don't see how you're going to pay me. And I don't work for free. I've coins set aside. I'm sure we'll agree terms. How much would you ask? A fair price. So, how will it be? I'll help you. Grand! Knew a witcher wouldn't let me down. Not like some waffly prick from Clan Drumden. Or Clan Drummond. Good luck, Witcher. Fare you well. Wait. Where should I look for you? What? Once I finish, where will I find you? Oh, oh aye, aye. Um, here. I mean, in, in the tavern nearby. I'll await you there. Fine. See ya. You sure fucking show that icy horse on it.
friends. We should...